This is the second video in this series, and we're going to work with data types in JavaScript. Go ahead and read the instructions here. We're going to have three variables, first integer, first decimal, and first strings. We need to perform some conversion, and then we need to perform some operations. If you read the code here, you understand the inputs. We have second integer, second decimal, and second string like this. And the output formats, which is what we have to print in the console, is going to be the sum of first integer and second integer. And then on the second line, we're gonna have the sum of first decimal and the floating point representation of second decimal. Then we're gonna have on the third line, first string concatenated with second string. And we have to print first string before second string. They give you a bit of explanation here to clarify how this challenge works, but this is what your code is supposed to look like. We can actually remove these comments here, but I'm going to leave it since this tutorial is for absolute beginners. So we have this function. It takes the three parameters that I mentioned here. And then here we declare and initialize the first integer with four. Then first decimal here becomes 4.0 because this is a decimal number and this is an integer. So I believe that this is already provided in this challenge. And then here they want us to declare a variable named first string, which is initialized to hacker rank. Now here I have console log and I'm adding first integer to second integer. Remember how they described second integer? It's a string. So when I'm adding first integer to second integer, I need to convert it to an integer first by passing it as an argument to the number constructor. Then here I need to print the sum of first decimal and second decimal. So I have first decimal here. And then once again, I convert second decimal, which is a string as they've explained here. I convert it to a number like this, and then I add it to second decimal. And then finally here, this is the concatenation. First string, remember, is a string as we can see it here. So we can easily concatenate it with the second string. Now, when you run this code, you can pass the test case. One thing you need to keep in mind is if you come here and you remove the space after hacker rank and you try and run this code, now it's going to fail because there is no space between hacker rank and the rest of the sentence. And this sentence is what they pass as inputs. Make sure that in your code here, you add this space and then run it again. And this time around, it will pass the test. Now let's submit this code. We have three test cases and we've passed all of them. So that's it for this hacker rank challenge. Let's move on to the next tutorial. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and I'll catch you next time.